What's up, Qso here, and today we're gonna have another crafting video. And today I'm gonna teach you how to craft a plus two to all chaos skill gems. Uh, that is assuming all of your chaos skill gems are intelligence based. Uh, if there's, if it's a toxic rain, that would be a dexterity based. So you would need a dexterity uh, skill gems instead. Either way, uh, I hope this video will prove for a nice template for other crafting projects. So crafting has two sides of a coin, prefixes and suffixes. And just about every craft, you wanna focus on one side at a time. So first up, we need a hunter base. That's where we find plus one to intelligence gems. We roll the uh, plus one to intelligence with uh, alterations because uh, plus one to intelligence is the hardest mod to get on this amulet. So as you can see here, uh, plus one does not have a tag we can use with harvest. It also has a very low weighting, so you're gonna have to count on something like 500 to 700 alterations before you hit it. Once we do, with an aug and regal, and we hope that we get uh, everything that we aug and regal, we hope that all of that is removable with harvest. If we get a non-removable tag on the suffixes, that's fine because we can use uh, prefixes cannot be changed and then scour it. If we get a non-removable tag on the prefixes, we're gonna have to pray that the annul hits what we need it to hit. So once we get to this point where we have uh, plus one to int and we have removed all of the uh, stuff that we don't need, we want to, like I mentioned earlier, focus on one side of the coin. And the side of the coin we wanna focus on are the suffixes. And to do that, we need to fill out the two remaining prefixes. And we do that by, uh, first we, we benchcraft something random, uh, let's say mana. We then augment something with harvest. And what we don't wanna aug at this point is chaos. And what we also don't wanna aug is cold fire or lightning because all of those are mainly suffixes, but we also have uh, prefixes as well. We have more, uh, we actually have more suffixes than prefixes. So the chances of us augging a prefix with an elemental, uh, with an elemental tag is going to be very low. Uh, our, our other options are attack, which does have a lot more attack uh, tags on the prefixes. Uh, it does, however, have two on the pre uh, suffixes. So uh, the safest, I feel, is going to be physical. Because physical has one, two, three, four tags on the prefixes, but only one on the suffix. So if we, um, if we aug, um, if we aug a uh, fizz on the suffixes, uh, we can just do add remove fizz and, uh, until we get it on the prefix. So once we have filled all of the prefixes, we can now start working on the second hardest mod to get, which is Chaos Over Time Multiplier. So if we have a look-see at Chaos, we have Chaos Resist and we have Chaos Damage Over Time Multiplier. Uh, we also obviously have Chaos to, to Skill Gem, but that's a prefix, and we just fill the prefixes, so we can no longer hit a prefix. So Chaos Over Time Multiplier has two different uh, tiers. As you can see here, these two, I can't seem to mark everything but that one and that one. And obviously we want tier one. So overtime multiplier has a weighting of 500. Chaos resistance has a weighting of, well, uh, 1500, because you're gonna have to count in all of the different tiers. So we are most likely, the chances of us hitting chaos resistance is going to be insanely high. So we aug chaos, and we're most likely uh, hitting chaos resistance here. We then aug chaos again. As we can see here, there are only a total of, <laughs> a total? <laughs> There's only a total of uh, two chaos mods. So we have a 100% chance of hitting uh, the chaos over time multiplier. Uh, we do, however, only have a 50% chance of hitting the tier one. So let's say we hit tier two. That's not what we want. So we have a couple options here. Uh, we could do remove chaos 
and hope that it removes this guy here so we can aug again and uh, to hope and hit tier one but if it removes the chaos resistance we're probably better off removing chaos uh, another one more time and then aug twice again or we do add remove chaos uh, until it hits the tier one here so add remove is going to either you know change the chaos resistance a couple tiers or it's going to hit the chaos over time multiplier i'm not really sure which one is the best one uh, cost wise uh, but most likely i want to say it's add remove is probably your best bet to try and hit the chaos so once we have the tier one uh, we will have to gamble once again by using uh, remove chaos because there's no there's no way of uh, removing this one specifically so we use remove chaos and we hope that it removes this so we do remove chaos and we hope that it hits this guy so now that we finally have the tier one uh, we want to work on the prefixes now but we have two slots open on the suffixes right now so we want to fill this out with um, either random uh, uh, either random resists or the ones you specifically want so we could you know do aug cold uh, and we can do aug lightning so now the suffixes are uh, they're more or less done so let's say these are the two resists that you're actually looking for uh, you can just save these for later for add removes. So we're going to go back up to, to the prefixes to get the plus one to chaos. So what we do is we remove this. We remove this over here, Fice. Uh, we also uh, remove the crafted mods, uh, re remove the mana. So now we have two prefixes open. So if we go back to PoEDB, we can see that there's only a total of two chaos mods on the prefixes. So the chaos damage to each life has a higher, uh, has a better weighting than the plus one. So we're most likely on our first aug chaos. We are going to hit chaos leech, and then on our second aug chaos, we are going to 100% get plus one to chaos skill gems. Now, we're, we are in a little pickle here because we have two Chaos Tags here, but it just so happens that Chaos Leech has a Life Tag. So what we do on the Leech is we remove Life. So now we have a prefix open for, you know, whatever we want. We could, uh, you know, Benchcraft Life or we could Benchcraft Energy Shield or we could do uh, Add Remove Life if we're Life Based. Uh, until we have hit tier one life um, you know th this last prefix here is up to you and yeah that is the video guys and that is how you craft a uh, very easy and beautiful plus two to chaos skill gems if you have any requests for anything crafting videos uh, passive excel for dummies stuff you know anything just leave a comment down below and i will see you guys in the next video